Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to another video. We are going to do some guild battles. Let's go straight into it. We against Ares, uh, we almost won. Uh, I'm not sure how many battles or swords we have left. Where can I see that? Numbers? Yeah. 21, so quite a lot. Um, I know... I believe Gian forever wanted me to show his defense, so I will do that. But first, let's... Attack some green towers because they're probably some oh, left over here. So Mr. Jin is one of the towers that's full and we had another tower that just got attacked. Okay, I'll just attack Mr. Jin. So let's see how we're gonna do this. First match. No, we don't gonna run yet. Uh, what we are gonna do is definitely bring in my Jultan because Jultan will take the damage off him. Second, mm, secondly, we will take you. So we take you or something else. Ah, uh, what else? I need a healer, which is not light. I guess we could take Platy. So, so, yeah, that, that could work. Second team, we have Viona, we have Bella Jewel. So, let's just use Bella Dion. And let's just kill their Teomars over and over again. I hope that they don't kill my units over and over again. Okay, let's see if we can get a stun. Yeah, we did get a stun, which is actually nice. Um, what else? Stun you. Let's silence and stun Chisun. So we don't have to deal with that. And uh, we are gonna try and kill Jultan first. Ah, Fallen Blossom still comes in. That's alright. Just a second. Defense break. Ooh, nice extra turn. This could potentially kill him. I didn't. And that kinda sucks. Uh, okay, um, let's. Let's just heal him up. Why did I not. Why couldn't I do a squall? I don't know. Don't proc, don't proc. Come on. Get rid of you now. There we go. That makes things a bit easier now. Yeah, let's just kill their Grogo. Doesn't seem like too much of a problem. Goodbye. Oh, fuck. Die! There we go. Easy. And then we just flash play. That wasn't too hard. Platy is really good for the Guild Wars because she has like a lot of control in her in this in the team. Oh damn it! Sanctuary. Damn it. Wish that didn't happen. Yeah, let's just heal and see if we can keep you alive. One proc, that would be awesome. Damn it. I do not get anything. Uh, no, just attack him. Wah, nice, that's good. Okay, you're dead, you will get revived. And that's fine. I hope the revive is actually before this, yes. And then we can try and take it out again. Damn it. <laughs> it did not work. I think he's dead. Yes. Let's go for Velajul because that's actually one of their damage dealers. Heal! If Velajul dies, 
It's like GG. Even though he, he can or even though she can revive, doesn't really matter too much. Because if she revives Dilmarsh, she will die. Like he will die instantly. And if he revives Felagil, that could be a problem, but Felagil doesn't cause me any danger. Okay, let's still try to kill you first. You will die, so let's go for you. You will die. Uh, that kind of sucks because now I have to revive him. Ooh, okay. I was a bit scared that I maybe could not revive him. But luckily I can and win the match without losing you. Sometimes I win ma matches where one of my units dies and I cannot take the other one. It's like, yeah. <laughs> so I believe Gian forever wanted to see his defense. I'm not 100 sure if it was him. It could also be Forever Gen. So I guess I'll just attack both. Let's start with this. So his first team is really uh, like a lot of immunity and a lot of damage as well. So how am I gonna do this? Let's think about it. I mean, you want to kill him. There's basically two ways to do it, and I think I'm gonna take the risk, the kind of risky way, but fast. Because if my Belladon gets resisted, I'm in trouble. If it, it doesn't get resisted, I should be fine. If these two, but we'll see. Uh, second fight. I actually think I can copper that or even Katarina let's just use Katarina or copper mm, no I'm gonna use copper I'm gonna use copper where's Chloe because I can I gotta think who to take out, but I think the Rowley Magician I'll take out him first. That. Ooh, no glancing at don't glance. Phew. Okay, now it's important to, that this actually hits. Okay, that does it. Let's put the Oblivion and Defense Break on, then it should be GG. There we go. This should be GG. Bam. There we go. As I said, it's the quick comp, but it has some. It can basically fuck up, but uh, it's it's pretty. I think it's pretty safe because it's like if if you get him down first turn, it's like over already. If you don't, you still have a chance of winning because it's not like uh, I will die instantly towards the towards the enemy. Although. Depending on who Theomars attacks, because if Theomars attacks my Theomars, I won't die, but I think it will be very difficult for me to keep Theomars alive. If he attacks uh, my Fire Ifrit, I'm fine, because he has he has quite a lot of defense and decent amount of health, so he can survive a few hits. And if he attacks Bella, it could be devastating. It could also... It could survive like two or three hits but it could be devastating who knows but it was a quick win because this works if I get resisted it was a whole different story let's see what you're doing okay he didn't buff he is gonna hurt me but I'm gonna take out this dude because he's gonna be annoying and now we're gonna work on You counter okay. No stun. Uh, yeah, just heal. Ignore the advance. That will be perfect. 
and it's three against one, which should be a win for me. Should be. Extra third? No. Too bad. Uh, yeah, let's move buff immunity. Why? And let's just keep. Let's just keep going. Can we crit? Yes, there we go. That's enough. So, that's how I beat your defense. I think the defense overall, uh, the first, I mean, talk about this. First one is just good. I think it has everything you need. Um, if I got resisted, I would have troubles. The second one, I think you need to speed up the Orient to. I don't know how fast your Orient is, but if he actually steals a turn, that would be perfect. Uh, if not, that's an all. That's a lot harder. Like if if he doesn't steal a turn, a Chloe is so good against that team. I don't know. It it wasn't bad. Don't get me wrong. It was not bad. Okay, how are we gonna deal with this team? Um, uh, what about? Taking Yona anyways, even though we have a duel done. Or should we? We could also do both. And then there's. Ah, no, 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 no. That's not smart. What else can we do? We could also maybe just use. No, I wanted to say maybe use Katrina. Well, I could, but then I would do Katrina together with Jameer so I can do it twice. It's just a little risky because I have to lens it and this unit has a lot of health, but I'll try it. Second match is gonna be something where I do want immunity for sure, even though he removes it. Bar or have Barris hit something. Let, let me just think this through really. Wait, he doesn't have immunity, so let's just bring Orion. And we'll take Iona. Iona will take all the hits of Barris. And I think he should be able to survive that. So let's see what's gonna happen. He is well, pretty good protected from this damage. So let's see what we get. Ooh, okay, not terrible. Both again. Let's see. What do we get? One, one. Ah, still no kill. Still no kill. Sanctuary, she will heal. Oh, she didn't. Ah, oh, she already did heal. Never mind. Can we kill him? Or her, shall we? We did great. So nice, we got that down. That's pretty nice, because now we kinda won. It was a bit of a <laughs> tricky fight, for sure. But we won, so who cares? Uh, yeah, that, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Okay, we outspeeded your virus, which means I have a good chance at this, but he also defense breaking, that's awesome. Not sure if he's gonna move. Okay, he did move, but he did not go for... Oh, counters. That's gonna hurt, because he's gonna fall on blossoms. Yeah. I need to get rid of you. Somehow. Let's try to stun something. Okay, we got a stun, but not on... The person we needed to. Damn, that counter. Like, he has... That's nasty. That's nasty. Come on, proc, proc, proc. Do I get a turn before? 
do I get a turn before? Yes, we should kill him. When Varus is dead, I should be fine. There we go. Varus is dead. But dang, that's a that's a uh, nifty uh, team you got there. Just, just go for stuns. Because Varus has that. Too bad I could uh, outspeed you because that really made it a lot easier for me. But the counter on Varus <laughs> did very well in this fight for you. So that was it. I got it done. Basically because Orion. Because of Orion I, I got this fight done. Which I'm really happy that I got a really fast Orion because that's really how I win a lot of fights in Guild Wars uh, as well. Like there are other monsters that have attack gauge boost but this one has a lot of control. So yeah, definitely some nice fights over here. I gotta say it wasn't that difficult overall but I think the defense you put up in the second round was very very nice the first one I'm not so sure I mean your damage comes from Belazul and we have every element I just don't know man it is again really like it's a bit dangerous against Katarina, Skullpurs, stuff like that I mean if you don't have the, the units for that it, it's a good defense but I kinda had no problem against it but I gotta say I mean Obviously, we're not the we're not the, a weak girl or like another. We're pretty strong, even though I have to say that about our own build. I mean, we got into top that, uh, five consistently, top three, I would say, last uh, month. Like we have been second and, and third quite a lot lately. Um, even though Iris is also one of the top builds, I mean, we should both be able to defeat. Uh, each other's defense is quite successfully. Uh, let me actually see how my defense does. I gotta wait. Aeris, okay, we gotta attack by Aeris, right? Yes. Why did I get attacked so much by Aeris? I got one draw on Ryander, a successful even. Then that's unexpected. And this guy is called Chrome. Isn't there a guild gonna be made named Chrome? So my defense did okay. Razzy and Thunder D. Thunder D I expected to defeat me. Razzy, I kinda expected as well. Ryhander, I thought he would win, but he lost the first round. Um, my first round is pretty tough, it has a lot of control. The second round will improve because this Chloe is gonna be just soon, most likely. I have to change it up a little, but I'm gonna change this whole setup probably. But for now, I'm gonna leave it. Just soon is not ready. Well, she is, but she's not awakened, so she's not ready. Like I got her. I'll show you quickly the runes right now. So she's level 40. Plus, well, she's. Full HP has zero accuracy, which I dislike that. Um, but she is violent. Just a left. Over. I, I need to max her out as well, so um, it's definitely not done yet. But I want her to have some accuracy, so this has a chance of hitting. But right now, I got her on violent um, as broken set because that worked better for me. This rune is like not that great. It has defense speed and resistance, which is good, but that's it. You know, I want some help as well there, or accuracy. This rune is okay, like 11 speed. That's not bad. This rune is okay again, and this is uh, nice for the speed. So these are just leftover runes on her, but uh, it will work. She's decently fast. She has a good health pool, so she will work. I Means she's faster than my uh, team war, so. That's that's always good. Quite a bit faster actually. And faster than Jilton. Yeah. But that was it guys. Um, the end of the video. I do gotta say uh, tomorrow, if I'm correct, I'll be summoning with uh, YDCB. I'm gonna be on his video. I'm gonna do summoning. I saw him doing it with other uh, people and I thought, oh, that, that's fun. And I thought it was good. 
a good idea for me uh, to go and summon him because one, it's fun, and two, it's it I mean he's like a way bigger YouTuber than me, so it, it's fun, right? That's that's smart, and also gives me some maybe some recognition as a YouTuber. So like a lot of his people maybe that don't know me. That's a but that's possible. So I thought that was a smart idea. I however need to spend my crystals on some scrolls because right now I only got six and I'm not gonna come in there with just six scrolls. But hey, um, that's fine. That's not a problem. So look forward to that video. I don't know when he will upload it, but tomorrow evening we're gonna summon it at least. So uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that as well. I hope you guys do so too. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.